All right. Good afternoon. Welcome. Uh, thank you for joining us today. I am Monica Settlemeyer, the Director of Communications and Marketing for the City of Waco. And on behalf of the City of Waco, along with our Park partners for this event, which is Baylor University, Lowell Observatory, and Discovery, we are grateful that you have joined us today. Waco is privileged to be the host city for the Eclipse Over Texas 2024, live from Waco, now just a year away. I would like to introduce our first speaker. Dr. Danielle Adams is a cultural astronomer and serves as the Chief Marketing and Revenue Officer for Lowell Observatory in Flagstaff, Arizona. Dr. Adams. Thank you so much, Monica. It's wonderful to be here with you all. Uh, Lowell Observatory's mission is discovery, to study the universe and to share that wonderful information with the world. And I can tell you from firsthand knowledge that experiencing a total solar eclipse is one of the most incredible things you can do in your life. It's an amazing experience. Uh, let's go to the next slide here, or the first slide. This map shows the eclipse path going through Texas, and Waco is ideally situated to be a prime location for observing the eclipse. Now, you've probably seen maps like this before. And you wonder, well, what's the difference being in that path versus being outside of the path? Let's look at the next slide. This is what it looks like until you get to totality. Uh, we're going to practice good eclipse safety and use glasses like this. And you're going to have your glasses on watching the eclipse starting about uh, 1240 uh, p.m. Uh, and going until 3 o'clock. Uh, the eclipse will have these amazing environmental effects. The weather will get uh, cooler as the skies get darker. The sky takes on this really interesting silvery sheen. And we're going to watch through these glasses as the sun gets smaller and smaller, becoming like a crescent. 
But that is not 99% of the show. It's maybe 10% of the show because something amazing happens when all of the sun disappears. Let's go to the next slide. We're gonna take our glasses off at that moment and see the sun completely covered by the moon. And it's only at that point that we can see the solar corona emanating out from behind the moon. Let's look at that closer. Beautiful, and this doesn't even begin to capture what you will see with your own eyes. And then the next slide. I love this picture. It gives you a sense of the totality of your experience during totality. You will have a 360 degree sunset all around you. Um, you'll see stars and planets that you would normally only see at night because the skies are so much darker. And you see this beautiful image of a velvet hole in the sky surrounded by the brilliant streamers of the solar corona. This, for four minutes, is the reason why people will travel from all over the world to come to Waco to see totality here. This is the difference between being in that zone and outside where it's a partial eclipse. Now, if you're in the zone, that's awesome. Anyone here in Waco can see this with glasses and then you take your glasses off when you get to totality. But then for the full experience, we are putting on a wonderful event in partnership with the city of Waco and Baylor University and Discovery at McLean Stadium in order to have um, all kinds of things happening with uh, speakers, astronomers and researchers uh, to talk about current research in astronomy and explain what's really going on in the sky with the eclipse. We're going to have food trucks and this wonderful carnival kind of atmosphere, a festival for the solar eclipse. And I encourage you uh, not just to make your way to Waco, but to join us in this wonderful event, Eclipse Over Texas, live from Waco. Thank you so much. Great. Thank you, Dr. Adams. Now I'd like to ask our mayor, Dylan Meek, to say a few words. Here. I am uh, fired up after that. Uh, hi, everybody. Thanks for being with us today. Um, I want to start by thanking our uh, dedicated staff uh, for preparing today's event, um, including but not limited to um, the attention to detail, like having moon pies and star crunch cookies in the back, um, as well as the thoughtful playlist when I walked in, um, Bad Moon Rising was playing over the speakers. And that is the attention to detail the White Coast is known for. So well done, team. Uh, as always, I appreciate our partnership with each of these um, institutions uh, sitting here on the stage with me. I'm excited about partnering creatively um, on this. Waco is the perfect place to experience the 2024 eclipse because we're, as mentioned, geographically located near the center line of the eclipse pass, which will allow a relatively long period of totality. Additionally, in the last several years, Waco has become a go-to tourist de destination in its own right. Um, Waco has become a go-to tourist destination in its own right. When you're here, you can visit things like the Magnolia Market, um, Waco Surf, which is uh, a surf park in Waco, um, Dr. Pepper Museum, the Texas Ranger Museum and Hall of Fame, our Texas Sports Hall of Fame, and so many other attractions in this community. I think visitors to Waco, Texas will find Waco as a unique blend of Southern charm, urban energy, with small town hospitality. The culture of this community is um, consistent with having friendly people uh, in, a dis in a distinct personality that's reflective of local business and our cultural institutions that I mentioned. The eclipse is going to occur Monday, April 8th, but come through the entire weekend with a kickoff concert on Friday night with an evening glow fun run, an eclipse art exhibit, and other activities that families and people from all over the world would enjoy experiencing. We encourage our local businesses to join in now and get involved in, on how they can um, partner with us to make this a really festive and enjoyable weekend. Thank you guys so much. 
Great, thank you, Mayor. Baylor University, as I stated um, before, is one of the partners in this event, and I'd like to introduce you to Jeremy Vickers. He is the Associate Vice President of External Affairs, and he will say a few words as well. Thank you, Monica. We're excited about partnering on this event, not only because it is a great opportunity to showcase the city of Waco, Baylor's hometown, uh, also it is a great opportunity for Baylor, a preeminent Christian research university, to highlight its amazing facilities, both athletics and research. And my favorite part is highlighting our amazing science faculty, particularly our Department of Physics. So what I'd like to do is introduce uh, our chair of the Department of Physics to highlight a little bit more about some of the fun activations and creative ways we're using their amazing skills to support the local community. Could you please join me, Dr. Lauren Matthews. The fact that we're able to predict this wondrous event and start planning for it a thousand days in advance is a triumph of science. And the faculty in the Department of Physics is really excited to share in the joy we get every day studying the wonders of God's creation and how it works with the rest of the community. We have several events planned in the year leading up to the eclipse and in the days immediately preceding the eclipse. We're going to kick off by hosting some teacher workshops for our local educators. These um, workshops will be held in the fall and in the spring and will equip our teachers with fun, hands-on activities to engage their students in the science that is associated with the eclipse. If teachers are not able to attend the workshops in person, we will have these available online on the Eclipse website with videos and materials that will be available in both English and in Spanish. April 4th through April 8th, we will be hosting an international scientific conference, and we expect hundreds of scientists from all over the world to join us and share their research that is related to the sun and the plasma streamers coming out from the sun. That's my area of research, as well as other events that are associated with astronomy. In addition, we're going to involve all of our students on campus. You'll notice first that all of the members of our astronomy club will be involved in the teacher workshops, the scientific conference, but will also be available the day of the eclipse to help set up telescopes and safely view the event. But we're also engaging students from all departments in the university. So we are going to have presentations from departments ranging from theater arts, who will have um, dramatic readings and as well as events related to the eclipse to the Department of Environmental Science. So we really hope that you will join us here on campus on April 8, 2024, and learn about all of the wonders that are associated with this magnificent event. Great, thank you both. So as we prepare and plan the details of this historic event, Clips Over Texas Live from Waco 2024, today we are excited to announce that the tickets will go on sale at noon on our Clips event website, which is www.eclipseovertexas2024.com. Your tickets will get you access to McLean Stadium, and we have two ticket options, a general ticket and a VIP ticket. The general admission ticket includes access to the following. Guided eclipse viewing by expert, expert solar astronomers, telescopes for public viewing, science presentation and steam zones, a pair of the certified solar glasses, and access to memorabilia and souvenir vendors. The VIP experience provides a more comfortable and intimate total solar eclipse viewing opportunity. In addition to the benefits of the general admission, the VIPs will experience dedicated telescopes for solar viewing, direct access to astronomers, exclusive STEAM activities and science presentations for all ages, a VIP hospitality bag, and access to designated seating and easy access from the main gate, food, and refreshments. So again, tickets may be purchased today starting at noon at our event website. And lastly, I want to make one, um, one thing. Our event partners together have set aside a limited number of complimentary tickets for our community members who may need financial assistance in obtaining a ticket. We will be providing more information and details on this by mid-April with um, activation and availability of those tickets by May 1st. 
We thank you for joining us today in celebrating this exciting event as we look forward to having you joining us along this journey and meet us back here in one year. Now we'll take any questions that you might have. Yes. We have around 20,000 tickets that will be available. And as um, was initially stated, um, this will be um, outside of McLean Stadium um, on Touchdown Alley. <laughs> yes. So um, we actually started over a year ago um, in planning for this event. There is a magnitude of, of various event logistics that we want to work through. But additionally, we want the community to get excited and involved in this. We want businesses to be able to think through ways that they can participate, maybe that they can get our community um, interested in this. And additionally, as was stated before, we've got people from throughout the world that will want to come. And so ensuring that we've got some of those details and logistics available now um, is key. The uh, pricing for the tickets will be live on the website when that goes when that goes up here at noon, and so you can um, check out all of those availabilities at that point in time. Great. Well, we thank you for coming today and for joining us, and we are excited to see you back here again in a year. Thank <laughs> you.